Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favor and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for just being you. You just pushing out love and light, healing and letting go and moving on to the next level. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell at the bottom so you know when your girl's about to upload her next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough please go ahead and drop me a line or two I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you just up tell me about your impact to give and how it impacts your life and head you towards a positive direction and if you feel like the video has been very informative to you and gave you the vibes you would love to share with a family or friend Please go ahead and do so and while you're at it go ahead and give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites as well And once again, thank you so much for the love and support you're giving to the channel And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video And today this beautiful music I'm listening to today is connect to the to the source stimulate and sec uh, synchronize your energy power with the source binarial beats and I will post that link in the description box below and the video I'm doing today is Twin Flame 101. Hey, Okas, you see clearly. You see clearly now the rain is gone. Yes, I love that song. Yeah, Yo, you remember that song? I can find... What is it? What is it? I can see clearly now the rain is gone. Now I can see all the obstacles in my way. You know, something like that. But anyways... I used to love that song. It's just like, and it's true though. You can see ops, all the obstacles in your way, but we're able to get around them. It's just like when we go through with certain things and it's like, um, you know, it, it's just like when we go through certain things and it's like we're in the heat of the moment. We're upset. We're pissed. You know, like, why did this have to happen? You know, this and this and that. And, you know, I've been pushing out love and light and then bam, this happens. And it's just like, you're aggravated, you're, you know, you hating the world right now, you're probably hating people, but then when you finally, when, you know, all the rain is, come, you know, done finished, you know, washing, wiping everything out, and, you know, everything looking fresh and wet, you know, you see all the reasons why, you know, you had to go through this, you had to go through that, you know, it might have gave you extra strength, you know, you've probably been paying for pay, you know, praying for patience, and next thing you know, you got put in a predicament where you had no choice but to wait. Or, you know, you're asking God for faith and you have something that plays on your faith where all you have to do is trust on faith. Be, you know, have that faith and trust in yourself. So it's just like certain situations we go through, we get upset about it. It, it can be confusing at times. And you're just like trying to figure out why me? <laughs> just why me? It just seems like the one thing after another after another. Like it's with me. You know, it's like I enjoy what I do, but it just feels like they ain't enough daggone time in the day. And I'm just like, God, dog, I've just finished doing this. Now I got to get ready to do live. Then I catch up doing live and having a good time. And just, then it's like time to go get my daughter. Then when it's time to go get my daughter, then I got to go ahead and finish cooking. Or, you know, and it's just like after that, after that, after that, you know, and it's just like. <laughs> you know, I need to. I need to. I need me time for I snap, you know, so it's just like, but when I look at all the things that I'm going through, I know all the hard work and determination I'm doing, it's going to pay off and get me somewhere. You know, I might be tired by now, but it's just like, I look at this time next year and I'll be laughing like, girl, you remember what you were doing last year? You were working your butt off doing this and this and this and that. Now look at you now. You're still working your butt off, but you're actually doing things that you love. That, you know, you're working towards the things you love now, but it's like, it's going to enhance, you know, a lot much more so it's just like when we when we go through our situations we have to learn okay there's a reason behind these things because it's just like the pain and the struggle we go through it brings us a lot of strength because if you notice a lot of times you see people in these movies or you see other youtubers talking about i had to sacrifice this i had to go through this i was broke i was homeless they went through all these things and now they got all this 
you know, luxurious stuff. They got these big homes. They're able to record in all these different places, go to all these different, you know, countries and stuff like that. That's a blessing. You know, and some people see that if you're seeing the tail end of it, you get upset like, dang, they didn't work hard for this. But if you haven't been with them since day one, on seeing how they started from the bottom and they got there, you know, when you know when you sacrifice something or you have to put something on hold or you have to wait on something, it might be frustrating. But trust and believe things are going to come right in on when you least expect it. When you know you keep, you know, you keep hustling and on that grind for the things that you want, miracles tend to happen when you don't give up. So don't give up, you know, and it's just like you, when you just sit down, all you got to do is just sit down and when you go through a situation, try to look at all the possibilities, not just in a negative sense. Don't think off of emotion. Try to think out of logic. And sometimes that's hard for us to do, especially if it just depends on the situation. Because you're like, Rosalind, you don't know about this situation. Girl, it made me mad and this and this and that. I understand that. <laughs> I understand that. But after you done did your woo-saws and your kumbaya yas, look at it from a different angle. Without all the emotions in it. You know, with my situation, I have to see things that I know I really don't care to see. I really don't want to see. But when I look at all the stuff and I sit back and look, I said, you know what? This is giving you strength. So if anything else comes at you, look at all the things you done dealt with. Look at all the things you had to put up with. Look at the things that people have put you through. The things that, you know, that scares you that you're getting put through. If you can endure all this stuff... When somebody come up and pop off at the mouth, all you are is going to look and laugh because it's not doing nothing. It's not paying a bill. It's not making you famous. It's not doing all that. So, you know, what you eating is not going to make me digest. So you have to just think of things like that. So it's just like when you're going through stuff, look at all your possibilities. Know that there's reason for you going through the things you're going through. There is meaning behind every single thing that you do during the day. Even on the decisions... To universe already know what decisions you're already going to make because they already know what you got to go through to get to what you got to get to so i hope you are able to resonate with the content of this video if you are up to it y'all please chime in on the live chat one in the in the afternoon and one in the evening we all have fun we talk about struggles the things that we have to deal with in life the things we resonate with current events or we're just shooting the shit and <laughs> having fun laughing there's never a dull moment so send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can have a blessed safe weekend be responsible for everything you do i'm sending uplifting loving comforting vibes healing vibes to whoever truly needs them and my post notification shout out goes to i got all these papers y'all um, let me see who am I going to, Mr. Robo Pig Nipples. I don't know where you got that name from, but I started busting out laughing when I heard that. I said, Okay, I'm, I should have no shame in my game by saying this name because y'all, <laughs> but much love to you, Pig Nipples, whatever. <laughs> much love to you, many blessings. I uh, hope you had a blessed, safe week and be responsible at everything you do. And while y'all are at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. Drop me a line or two. Yes, and let me know you hit the notifications and you're on the notification squad so I can go ahead and give you a shout out on my next video. And, you know, hit the notification and like and subscribe. And I'll see you on my next video. Peace and be wild.